okay so next problem is to divide a circle of a given radius into n equal parts okay so we are going to divide a circle into let's say 12 equal parts okay so let's start okay so suppose this is my circle okay Okay, this is my circle okay now what you have to do you have to draw the diagonal a b and c d okay you have to draw the diagonal a b and c d here So try to draw this diagonal using drafter. Okay, it will be good for you to get accurate drawing. Okay, so this is the diagonal. Okay, so they are intercept here at A, B, C, and D. Okay. Now with center at A. We center at a and radius equal to the given radius so i have not changed the radius you can see this is the given radius so you have to draw an arc okay in both side okay here and here okay similarly you have to draw an arc okay with center at b here and here okay similar thing you have to do okay by taking radius this one okay and by taking radius c okay so i have not changed the radius when a radius change nahi kiya only center change kiya okay i have only changed the center okay so these are my point okay now you have to uh, identify the point this point 1 this point 2 this is point 3 this is point 4 this is point 5 this is point 6 this is point 7 this is point 8 okay now they are equally distributed okay if uh, if you draw this thing this line from here to here so you can see that all are equally distributed okay so this is the way to uh, distribute a given circle into 12 equal parts next problem is to bisect a given angle okay so okay so th suppose this is my given angle okay this is a this is b and this is c okay now taking b as a center okay b ko center le lena hai and any convenient radius okay you have to draw a arc okay so this arc is going to intersect in ab at point d and in b b c at point e okay now taking e as a center and any convenient radius okay you have to draw an arc over here okay in in between this two angle in between this angle okay and similarly you have to draw an arc over here okay so this is the arc and this is the arc okay so this is my intersection point so suppose this intersection point is my f okay now you can join this okay so in this way we can bisect an a given angle okay now this angle this angle and this angle okay so both are equal this angle and this angle both are equal okay 